Muscle and Strength, it's Jonathan, IFBB Pro, Classic Physique, and today we got Delt Day coming at you. Let's get straight into it. We're starting off with the lateral flies. Get a couple of warm up sets in. Get those delts nice and fired up. Like having a nice big set of delts, it's gonna give you that crazy illusion of having a super, super small waist. So you just gotta keep pushing them and pushing them and pushing them. Lots of lateral flies and lots of rear delt flies. That's really gonna get those delts to cap. I always do my raises before my presses get those delts nice fired up. I go super heavy on my raises, and I'm gonna go super heavy on the presses as well. What I'm gonna do here, you run into my heavy set and do four working sets at a heavier weight. So if you're having trouble really feeling that lateral delt, what I'm doing is I'm focusing on taking my pinkies, if you'll see, my arms are actually a little bit bent when I do them. So I'm coming up and I'm forcing my pinkies towards the mirror a little bit. So I'm coming up kind of like this, and it's having all that lateral delt really pop out, get that big delt meat. So I'm gonna do my 45s again, for a set of 10, and I'm gonna drop by 10 pounds each time. Lots of partial reps. The blood flow is crazy, just keep it going, really. That's the main thing you wanna focus on when you're doing some lateral flies like that, especially a drop set. So basically what we're gonna do on this one, really, really nice, slow, slow reps. We're gonna put some weight on there for sure. It's in that eight to 12 range, very slow negatives. Make sure we're getting that nice, good pump. Weight's higher this time, but we still control it as if it was the first set. <laughs> Eight to 12, always. Weight gets heavier, just get tougher. From that press there, we're gonna actually go into a front press, beef up these front delts. What we're gonna do is cut the weight in half. And then we go more reps on this one. Nice, good control, but a little bit faster tempo. More, more like a piston in the car that we're just gonna pump it. We'll do four sets of that as well. Same weight, whole time.
something like rear delts, you really don't have to go crazy heavy. I mean, it's a very, very small muscle. So you're gonna be much, much more careful with that kind of muscle. So just getting up there and getting real nice pumps. I go wide, but for some guys who are more narrow, it might feel a little bit better to just bring in that grip. One more set there. Let me on four sets. Like I said, we're gonna pull this lean back, pulling it right to the face, all rear delt. Base pulls here. What I'm doing is I'm holding the ropes on the inside, inverting those hands, pulling right to the face, nice and deep. Really gonna target those rear delts. Build that density in those rear delts, make them really pop. delts is priority. If you're not hitting the rear delts, you're not gonna get a complete delt. Uh, you're not gonna really hit them completely from just doing rows and stuff like that. You have to actually target them on a delt day to fully get that delt look. So the last thing I wanna do for delts is another fly, but with the cable to get some more resistance. I love doing those really good resistance. Pulls that depth down as you're going up, and it makes you work a little harder. So do lateral flies, and then we're gonna tag a little bit of biceps. And then, that's all good. A little bit of blood in the arms. I like to tag something on my arms every upper body day, so. That's it. Got the curls in. That's the biceps for today. That's the delt day. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Be sure to subscribe below. <laughs>